Did you yawn? Because I just yawned and it's contagious. Huh? Just thought I'd ask. Anyways, clear up some of this here. A little smudge, got a little smuts. Ah, that's better. What up? Bench pressing. I'm on them free weights. That's at 225. You know I'm saying? My Instagram is TT. O N E two O two. That's when I talk. Uh, you know, I go live and talk about me doing fitness. But... Yeah. I was just thinking, what if Kyrie went to the Celtics? Because Celtics are saying, oh, that's the best fit for him. First, the Suns would like it's the best fit. Now the Celtics like that's the best fit for him. Saying, what if he went to the Celtics? Now, I was just thinking about that only because if he goes to the Suns, it doesn't. It's so ideal. But the Celtics play against the Cavaliers. Played against them in the uh, in the finals. Uh, excuse me, in one of the not the finals, the uh, playoffs, the last round of the playoffs. <laughs> And I'm thinking, would it make them better? I, I still don't think they'd beat the Cavs. Anyway, that goes. But let me get this two two twenty five before you know Supreme act like I ain't lifting. Act like I'm afraid of two twenty five. The Supreme be talking. He don't want me to come to New York and lift with him. <laughs> come to New York and lift with the Supreme. Get this two twenty five. I had to do that for Supreme because he he be in Brooklyn acting like he's the only one who know how to lift. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, so Kyrie going Kyrie going to a competitive team. First we was thinking about him going to the Spurs. I don't think he's gonna leave. I keep saying that, but let's talk about. If he does leave, who would you like to see him play with? Traded for Wiggins, Timberwolves. Says he's worth the max contract. Where'd you like to see him go? Celtics, Spurs. Stay in the same conference, play against them. Nah, the Spurs aren't in our conference, are they? Because <laughs> they played uh, Golden State. I'm going to tell you the truth. I don't like it. I don't like it when a team gets traded to to the competitor. Like Kevin Durant is never. You know what? I think I'm gonna stay there. I think I'm gonna stay at 225. Usually I go up to like 315, but I'm gonna stay at 225. I'm gonna do five sets at 225. But uh I don't like when the comp I don't I don't like when the competitor, when you go to the competitor, I, I think most people don't like that. Kevin Durant is never going to get his respect 
until he goes back to OKC and he properly beats Golden State. You gotta be at work. Yeah. It's just not gonna happen. I'm saying. Now, <laughs> if Kyrie was coming from the Celtics and moved to the Cavs, it'd be the same thing Kevin Durant did. But if he's going from the Cavs to the Celtics, for one, you, <laughs> LeBron is like, you know you're going to have to see me. <laughs> Any way around, you're going to have to see LeBron. If you're playing in a, in, on a winning team that is trying to make it to the championship, because I tell you all right now, I don't believe every team is trying to make it to the championship. Like the Lakers. Lakers aren't trying to go to the championship this year. They know they can't. They still have a raggedy team that they're building up. They're not even thinking about the championship game until about three or four years out. It's like, why even go there? I know right now I'm not capable of doing this. It's like somebody coming in the gym who ain't been here in years and trying to lift the heaviest weight with the big guys. It's like, you ain't... It don't work for somebody who ain't been here in a couple weeks. You just can't come in here and be the strongest guy in the gym because there's guys here every day. I mean, Golden State ain't going nowhere if they all stay together. <clears throat> They're going to stay at the top of the pile. Oh, I, ain't, I need to do my next set. Okay, kill for kill. I don't want you over there talking junk. You know what I'm saying? He'll be, he'll be talking junk every now and then. Him and Donald Gilbert. I ain't trying to hear that. Ten times. All right, Donald. <laughs> <laughs> Crank that out. Shoulder's still tweaking a little bit. My arm has been going numb. I gotta go to the doctor about it. I feel like one of my nerves or, or a nerve bundle is, you know, it's going all the way down my arm too, all the way to my hand. Go check the doctor and be like, Am I having a heart attack? I'm like, nah. So, but you never know. So I gotta go back. I'll go get a check out. Anyways, there's no team that he can go to that's gonna make him a better situation. Not even financially. But there are teams that he can go to to make us still want to see him. Not so much as a fan of him, but to see if his ability will enhance the team, not even past where he's at, because you, 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 you already got a ring, you've been there three times straight. Just what are you going to do at that team? Like, I would like to see him go to the Celtics. Because we know that he's going to run into LeBron. He has to. I don't want to see him go to the sorriest team in the same same conference. I want him to see LeBron on the, on the court. Like, I don't even want LeBron to, like, have a vendetta against him, like, to just beat the crap out of him on the court. Like, get that out of here. Make him look bad. Something that he'd do to Green. I just want LeBron to beat him and then look at him like, 
with his hands up like, what'd you expect? You know, I hope you're doing all right. <laughs> hope you're getting your money, boo. <laughs> but, uh, you know, you went the wrong direction. You should have stayed here. But still, I keep reiterating, I don't think he's leaving. I don't think Kyrie is leaving. You know, free agency is almost wrapping up too, ain't it? Of course, it's not a free agent, but... Mikey James, what's uh Mike knows. What's Kyrie's uh contract? How, what's the length of it? What's for the next two, three years? How much does he owe? How much does he owe? Mike Mike knows that. Yeah. Mike hates Jamatria too. <laughs> I hate Jamatria. <laughs> <laughs> so does Sanchez. I think Donald Gilbert is, he's not a Jamatri guy, but he's one of those really, really smart dudes that looks at everything numerically. <laughs> Skeptical about everything. That's a fake injury. That's fake news. <laughs> but you know, the world needs people like that to question things. The world needs skeptics. Skeptics are welcome here. I want to hear your doubts and fears about something. Collectively. You know what I mean? In uniformity. With passion. You know what I'm saying? The severity of it all. I like to hear that. Even if it's total opposite of what I think. I like it because it makes me look at something different. But as far as Kyrie's concerned, like I said, there's nowhere he's going to go that's going to be a better situation for him. All around. To me. That's to me. Okay, yeah. Oh, Oh, that was a good one. Did you guys yawn? Because I just yawned. It's contagious. It's contagious. Oh, I need to get. I need to get this done. All right. All right. Third round. Ten times, Mike. Mike, you live in the same city I do. You can come live with me. You can come get some of this two twenty-five ten times. Five sets of five. Five sets of ten. What you want to do, Mikey? <laughs> What's up? Up here at Crunch on Main Street. Getting it in. <laughs> Come get some of this. Government cheese. Whoa, I'm tired. do it today right now but I know if I do it'll spin me like I will have nothing left I'll be so worn out I'll just go home and go to bed I'll go home and rest for a couple hours and get up 
chi out and get my chi together. Sucking that energy. You guys ever watch the videos where Kyrie Irving plays against regular people? It's more entertaining than the games to me. I like it better than the actual games. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, so I just can't see him getting with the getting with the, anybody else, but I wouldn't mind seeing him with the Celtics. Yeah, the Celtics. You know what I'm saying? But if he did go somewhere, he'd probably go somewhere where LeBron ain't playing. <laughs> you already know. He he knows whatever team he's going to go to, if it's not in his conference, the same conference, he's not going to see LeBron on the court. How do we know this? Because if you're not in the same conference and you're not going to the championship games unless you're with Golden State. Period dot. Period dot. You don't play for Golden State? Spurs are not going to beat Golden State. Not this year. Next year they might. I already said they was going to win next year, didn't I? Did I say the Spurs is going to win? Yeah, I think the Spurs are going to... I, I say the Spurs will beat Golden State in the playoffs. That's my prediction. Just so they get rid of the juggernaut. Like a monopoly. But here's a kick in the pants. Here's a kick in the pants. You'd be looking at... So you'd be looking at, like everything is going to shake up next year because if LeBron goes to the Lakers, right, the Lakers automatically go to the playoffs. That's automatic. They go to the playoffs. What round they end up in, we don't know, but they go to the playoffs, right? And if Kevin Durant leaves Golden State and goes back to OKC or Washington, they become or stay playoff contenders. If he goes back to OKC, if he goes back to OKC, it'd be awesome. Go back, you know, get his dignity back. Russell Westbrook is on fire right now. He's turning up all day. Go back and, you know, go back and trounce him. Beat him. That's what I say. I think LeBron, I think uh, uh, Durant needs to get his respect back. There's only one way of doing it. There's only one way of doing it. So all us to it. Hell, he might make a lot more money if he did. You know Golden State is going to pay out the yin-yang trying to put my watch back on. You know what, I'm not even going to do it. Anyway, so, yeah, Kyrie, Celtics. Boom, bam, boom. I need to get this fourth set of 225. Who's with me? Mm -hmm. You guys are good. It's contagious. Who wants some of this? Who wants some of this 225? RZ11 2020 you want some of this 2020 I know you out there 2020 is my dude <laughs> we get this third it's fourth set right fourth set <laughs> all you Steeler fans <laughs> Steeler fans Sunny, 
What was her name that everybody knew in the 80s? The women's championship. You know what I'm talking about. Maybe the uh, Nah, she was. I can't remember all her names. Alright. Ten times, bring it by. Get my chin up. for your mind. Yeah. Yeah. Now, for my last set, now for my last trick, I'm going to throw on uh, two tens. Do that. Y'all act like I can't lift. I don't be appreciating that. Y'all act like I don't come to the gym. <laughs> like I don't be up here bench pressing. <laughs> Working out like Kyrie. <laughs> Kyrie's a little dude. Then again. Everybody's little when you're standing next to people who are seven feet. Ow. Yao Ming. I mean, Michael Jordan is 6'6. Six, six. But he looks small standing next to some of those dudes. Matumbo. <laughs> the mailman. You know what I'm saying? Jabbar. You know what I'm saying? Those dudes are huge. Yeah, that's that 245. You know what? Just because Donald Gilbert be talking noise, I'm gonna throw a five on there. Because I know he's talking. Like he gonna come up here and lift with me. I'm gonna throw two. What's that, two? Is that a five? Ew. Ew, I might not be able to do that. Ten times? Ew. Look at that. 245. Dude. That's 255. Yeah, that's 10 more pounds. Ew. <laughs> Donald Gilbert in the house. He's on fire. All right, Donald. Just because you be talking and I feel strong in my body. I know you're going to be talking about me. I'm going to throw five pounds on here. Just to show y'all a 49-year-old man. He's going to be 50 this year. <laughs> Put this all up in your mouth. 25. 45, 55, I never did this 10 times in my life, but, uh, let me give me a little rest, <sighs> get my chi up, I'm tired, this gonna be it for me, I usually go box, but I'm gonna actually go and eat, get some spaghetti or some carbs, I'm gonna carb up, some more water. I gotta go to Planet Fitness after this. Alright, 24 minutes. Alright, let me go ahead and do this. I don't know if I can get it 10 times. 255. I'll probably get it 
seven or eight. Maybe, right? Two fifty five. My man Donald. Oh, my own boy Supreme in Brooklyn. It's Brooklyn in the house. Fucking fresh. Fucking fresh. Uh. Cavs. Ten times. I couldn't do it. I'm tired. If I get eight times, I didn't even feel like straining for that nine one. Nine with a spot out of got him. I'm freaking tired. Screw it. I'm going home. It's boy tone two or two.